Do we get a lesson in surrealist art today? Yes, you do. Oh, that'll be that great. Is, that is right, Mary. So the Salvador Burger comes from the episode of the Art Crawl on Bob's Burger, and it's in tribute to Salvador um, Diel. No, Diel. Dolly. Thank you, Carrie Hawker Diaz. She's on the site. Uh, Salvador Dali, uh, and that's where it comes from. And it's a hysterical episode if you haven't seen it, but what a fun way to do it. So this burger here deals with some cauliflower, obviously. And so I wanted to show you a couple of different things here. So first of all, these cauliflower pieces I actually baked off, it's a little salt and pepper. This one I actually fried. So you can see the difference between the two and decide whichever kind you want to do at home. To create those slices, you're just gonna take the head of cauliflower and you're going to slice down. You don't want to remove the stem or cut them away from the stem because you're going to use the stem partly at, to hold everything together. And when you get to the point to where you basically cut all the stem away, what you're going to see are these, these little pieces of it, and you're going to use the small little pieces of stem to cut through and to keep those together. And so that's how you're going to do it. That's how I created the little slices of the cauliflower. And then you're going to drizzle them with olive oil, salt and pepper, into the oven for about 20 minutes or into the fryer for about two minutes. So it's just really whatever you choose to do. Now I've been getting some razz from some of my professional chef friends about french fries and it's hysterical because they're teasing me saying I don't know how to make french fries from scratch. So I'm going to show you how to make french fries from scratch today. These are russet potatoes that I've just cut up. I have a little french fry cutter and I just peeled, sliced them, blanched and then they were baked off in a 350 degree oven for about 10 minutes till they dried out. They've cooled down to room temperature. They're best if you put in the refrigerator, but they are ready now to go into the fryer. So today's hamburger, when we come back, I'll show you how to put it all together, is going to have the homemade french fries on it, which are going to be that much more delicious. And Mary, I did save you some onion rings, so good. You're good to go. They're the were, best. Those are great they onion are rings really good. yesterday. <laughs> you know, you haven't had a flop yet. Oh, thank goodness, yes. Ron yes. Bird. <laughs> a burger guy. <laughs>